And the fans are on their feet awaiting the start of this game as the players line up for the kick. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So the Badgers and their coaching staff, Kirk, just happy to have a guy like this in the program. Their offense really clicks when he's playing there. Well, I think it gives them the diversity that they're looking for. I mean, at times they're going to run the football. Other times they're going to try to air it out. And when you have one guy that gets so much attention on the outside, it just seems to open up other aspects of their offensive attack. And they've done a good job as an offensive staff of putting together a good plan. And I'm sure we're going to see it again today. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 26. Red two. Red seven. Red seven. Motion, motion, motion. He scrambled. Tackle made at the 32. He gained a good six yards on that scamper. Third down. over the middle and he tackles him hard at the 38. Hey it's a, it's a first down for this offense that keeps everybody enthusiastic. You can see the momentum that this offense is gaining. The coaches and the players on the sideline are fired up and hey it's a new set of downs. And the halfback carries for a pickup of three. It's second down six to go. Ball on the 41. Another run. They'll bring him down around the 41-yard line. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. He was playing the run all the way and was able to stop him quickly. Good job by that senior safety. at about the 43-yard line. This guy is one of the most reliable receivers around. They needed a big play on third down, and he got it for them. First and 10. Ball on the 43-yard line. Black five, black Nice run up the middle. That makes it second and six. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Red two, yellow two. And he's going to come up with a sack. Sometimes it's just a relentless pass rush that results in a sack. That's what happened there. They line up for another third down, and they've had no problem converting their first two. Go! Going deep. Now, I don't know if this quarterback misread the defense or just made a poor decision, but that wasn't a pass he should have thrown. He'll try to knock this punt down inside the 20. And this one is a beauty. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. They bring him down. Absolutely perfect call by the defensive coordinator. He brought just the right amount of pressure from the right direction, and it seemed to confuse the offense. So the sack makes this a second and long. Reset, cut right. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Mike the 59. Fires quickly to the tight end. And they make the stop around the 23-yard line. That makes it 37. Got it. Complete. He's out of bounds. 
defense. He had a couple of freight trains coming at him, but when they blitzed, it created a hole in the coverage, and they took advantage of it. From their own 35-yard line, it's first down. And they get nice yardage on that run. three yards to get the first down here on third down. He's tackled around the 42 yard line. When you get in these third down situations, a confident offense expects to get the yardage they need on the ground. It's a good job by the defense to shut that down. He really got a hold of that one. Little too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. This is a fun game, and I think we're going to see a lot of interesting football before it's over. And they'll get him in the backfield. I think anytime you lose yardage, it's frustrating as a ball carrier. It's very frustrating as a play caller. Makes you a little bit more hesitant maybe to go back to a certain play. The biggest thing you want to do as an offensive coordinator is get the offense over the sideline after the series. Make sure everybody's on the same page and then show the confidence that you still have in them despite this play that you're going to go right back to the running back and trust that offensive line. Third and 14. Ball on the 16-yard line. Black five, black five. Easy, easy. He airs it out. He's hit and taken down. Nice catch on that one. So at the end of one quarter, now this one's scoreless. Even first quarter as we head into quarter number two. Red two. And he snags that one. Nice pickup as they connect on the pass play. But they look to be in sync right now. They're both reading the defense properly, and the result is a nice gain. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. He's got the corner. Nice run, and he's brought down. Nice run there by the tailback, and it's good for the first. If you can consistently get four or five yards at a pop, you know that you're going to have a functioning offense. Green eye, green eye! Up the middle for a nice game. Second and six coming up here. Ball on the 10. And two, yellow. Loss of one there for the halfback. Here's the eighth play of the series. Nice catch there before he stepped out of bounds. That's good for First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. They put everyone up on the line. And he has it on the corner. Touchdown, Badgers! And he 
hits the PAT. A nine-play, 79-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Got some open field. Makes it out to about the 33. So it's second down and about two yards to go. And he's tackled at about the 35. Gaining two yards. That'll bring him third in inches. Man left, man left. Three down, three down. Check 59. Mike, Mike is 59. Mike is 59. He gets out to about the 35 yard line. From their own 35 yard line. First down. Down around the 36 yard line. That's a gain of one on the play. That makes it second and ten. Ready! And he shoved out of bounds at the 46. First and ten. Ball on their own 46. Quick throw. The defender had his hands on it, but it's incomplete. Boy, a golden opportunity missed by the defense. That was a sure interception only to be dropped. Off play action. Now he's on the move. And he's taken down right around the 42-yard line. From the 42-yard line, first down. Hands it to the back. He's got an opening. And down he goes at the 19. Just a simple draw play there, but they picked up some big yards. It's the ninth play of the drive. Quick throw, picked off. And that was just an outstanding pick. Great play by the defender to high point the ball, but the quarterback wasn't in rhythm on the throw. It's first down. Tough spot here, deep in their own territory. Wisconsin, up seven points. Ready? Taken down at the two. yards away here on third down. Red two, Ten. blue 20. Got the corner. That's a great tackle at the 16. Gain of nine yards. That makes it first and 10. So we've played two quarters. The Badgers in front, seven nothing.
we played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. People say college football is evolving. It's completely an offensive game. Boy, not this one. This one has that old school, hard nosed, tough feel to it. Yeah, and it's it's good. It's kind of it's kind of refreshing. I know the younger guys, you like all the points all the time, but it, it's fun to watch these kind of games because you see two defenses flying around. It looks like there's 12 or 13 guys on that side of the football making big plays, making big hits, holding the offenses down in a world where we have all the fast paced, up tempo, scoring points galore. It's good to see some defenses bow the necks and play some good, pretty good ball. Just about time to start the second half. What, what do you think Herb Street's first point of analysis will be? Uh, I don't know, something to do with quarterback play, I'm sure. I mean, we've got to hear that stuff all the time. It's all about the quarterbacks. <laughs> Brad and Kirk ready for the second half. The Welcome back, everybody. Second, second half, half action to about to begin. No he really got a hold of that kick. <laughs> and it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Wisconsin's continuing to play extremely tough defense. This has been impressive. It's just been impressive to watch them play with such an attitude, almost a chip on their shoulder with the energy that they're playing with. And I think it's going to require that kind of effort to be able to win this game. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Sends it out quick, intercepted. He seemed a little hesitant on that throw, and that left the defender time to break on the ball and pick it off. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 36. Wisconsin is up seven. Here they go on the draw, and they'll lose yards. One yard loss for the halfback. Drill at the 29. That's a team of eight on the play. Third down. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Gain of seven yards. First down. Dog four. Go. He might have a chance. He makes his way out to about the 12. Call the game of 10 yards. That'll make it second and inches. It's second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. Watch the screen, watch the screen. Watch the screen. Watch the screen. Green nine, green nine. Green eight. Motion, motion. Go. And he makes it out to about the 11 yard line. That's good for a gain of one yard. First down. Go. They'll run it. Touchdown, Wisconsin! Very impressive run by the halfback to find the end zone. Good play call here by the offensive coordinator. He realizes when you get down into the red zone and you have a halfback like this, just give him the ball and let him find his way into the end zone. And he converts the extra point. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Sends it sailing downfield. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Well, this defense has got to be proud of what they've been able to do in this football game so far. Love to see the goose eggs up there for this defense. And the way their offense is playing, this game is really shaping together for this team. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. 
Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. They bring him down in the backfield. Did you see how that big defensive line got such a good push on that play? That's exactly why they were able to stop him for a loss. Certainly, they don't have the return on here. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. Fielded at the 19. And Wisconsin showing right now that they are not content to sit back and just watch their lead disappear. They're adding to it. Boy, they're clicking right now on offense. They found their rhythm, and as you said, they're not looking back. They're trying to extend this lead and try to put this game out of reach. Based on what I saw in the last series, this defensive coordinator better make some adjustments in a hurry. His defensive line got manhandled. Right now, he's got to think about trying to attack the line of scrimmage. Fumble, loose ball. I really thought the defense had a chance to get their hands on it, but the ball went out of bounds first. That's got to be disappointing. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 45. Black now he tries to buy some time. He's brought down in the open field. Him hard at the 41. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 35. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. Tackle made at about the 27-yard line. That makes it first and 10. Red 2, green 15. Makes it to the 14. The defense doesn't seem to have an answer right now. They might need to change up some of their schemes. First and 10. Ball on the 14. Tackled after a decent pickup. That's good That makes it second and six. Fires quickly, touchdown! And that one worked just like they draw it up, Kurt. Yeah, Brad, you're exactly right. Offensive line did a good job of protecting the quarterback. Good route by the receivers. Results, touchdown. And he adds the extra point. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. They couldn't get anything going on that last drive. If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. Quick 
Strike to the receiver. Steps out of bounds at the 49. What a play. Boy, a solid job there by the quarterback, recognizing the defensive coverage and delivering the ball to the open receiver. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 49. At about the 49. No game. That makes it second and ten. And he throws it away. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 41. That could have been a huge shift in momentum if they were able to hold on to that one. Wow, that was close. That'll make it fourth and ten. Here's the punt. No, they're going to throw it. Looks left, intercepted. Brought down by the kicker. So at the end of three, the Badgers in front, 21-0. Back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. Second down, seven yards to go. Ten yards to the end zone. Run, 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 run. He fights forward to about the seven. the five-yard line. Fourth down. This one should be makeable. Kicks up, and they tack on three points. Kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. So the Badgers have really been all over the place. They're playing like a defense possessed. I love to watch a defense just pin its ears back and just fly to the football. They are playing with a reckless attitude, and it's really paid off because it's set up their offense to be able to score points. Quarterback couldn't maintain possession on their last drive. Let's see what he does here. Anytime you give the ball away, it's a disappointment. So these guys want to show that they can hang on to it. And he just gets rid of it. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. Throws complete, and he's hit right away. Tackles him hard at the 44-yard line. From their own 44-yard line. First down. Quick release, tight end, incomplete. So they run the same pass play again. Yeah, typically you'll see this when teams are having success with a particular player. They feel confident about a play's chances. Now he's scrambling. Now he's going to run and watch out. He's at the 40. 
It's always a snap decision when you decide to tuck it and run. On that play, it was definitely the right move as he got the first down after a nice game. From the 34-yard line, first down. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. And they push him out around the 26-yard line. Just under three to go in regulation. They bring him down. The defenders played the snap count perfectly. He found the path into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. Here's the eighth play of the series. Ready! Delivers to the halfback on the screen. And he's tackled at the 28-yard line. That screen gets around six. So they're going to go for it here. That makes it fourth and four. Makes the catch, and he's not going to get there. Great tackle. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Little handoff. He gets out to about the 28-yard line. Second and seven. Ball on their own 28. Red two. Green 15. Run, run, run. Runs it right. Nice pickup. That'll make it third and one. From their own 42-yard line, it's first down. Green nine, green nine, green eight. He'll get it again, taken down as he works the left for a nice game. That's good for a gain of five yards. That brings him second and five. This one's in the books, and our final score, 24 to nothing, Wisconsin. Kirk, go ahead and just give us your reflections on this game. Nothing adds to the pageantry of college football more than a good rivalry. This was a great game that should only add more fuel to the fire for next year's matchup, and boy, was it fun to watch. brings this broadcast to a close. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler. We'll see you soon for another edition of NCAA Football 14.